Now, the Tatas will officially take charge of Air India today. The handover is expected to take place shortly. Senior officials of the Tata Group will also be present for the official handover and the official transition of Air India will take place tomorrow. Now, the government has put out final legal notifications on Air India agreements, share purchase and transfer of assets. The Air India board will resign today officially to make way for the new team. As part of the Tata's takeover of Air India, meal upgradation on some of the domestic as well as international flights has already been suggested by Taj Sats, a Tata Group-led airline catering company that will kick off. The airline, in its earlier communication to its employees, had also informed its cabin crew to prepare for these full enhanced meal plans on flights starting tomorrow. Cabin crew have also instructed to turn up smartly dressed, referred to passengers as guests, and play out a special audio message by Ratan Tata, the new owner now on flight, among other changes that have been planned ahead of a big handover. In fact, uh, here is an uh, image coming in that you see of uh, Ratan Tata there meeting with Prime Minister Modi. Remember, this is after 69 years that the airline has finally been has come back to this conglomerate, the Tata Group. Uh, in fact, Ratan Tata himself meets with Prime Minister Narendra Modi. Uh, Tata is the chairman, of course, meeting with the Prime Minister right when the Air India board resigns. The Tatas officially now take charge of Air India. And this is the first image that we bring to you right here on India today. Ratan Tata meeting with Prime Minister Modi. Uh, it, it appears that uh, Ratan Tata now has finally settled this deal entirely with uh, Air India's board resigning, Tata Group taking complete control of Air India. This handover is expected to take place, in fact, shortly from now, right ahead of that takeover. Here is Ratan Tata meeting with the Prime Minister Narendra Modi. The Tata Group will be present for the official handover. Official transaction transition of Air India will take place tomorrow. All right, we, we believe that this is Tata Sun's chairman who's meeting with the Prime Minister Narendra Modi. Tata chairman there meeting with the Prime Minister. Let me cut across to Paulmi. She's bringing us more details on this. Paulmi, in fact, Tata chairman coming to meet with the Prime Minister Narendra Modi. In a little while from now, the official handover of Air India to the Tata group will take place. Take us through what more we know. Well, Nabila, we are standing right outside the airline's house the, right now. Uh, this is the headquarter of uh, Air India, where that formal handover is happening. Right now, as we speak inside this office, Mr. N. Chandrasekharan, Natarajan Chandrasekharan, who is the Tara Sense chairman, is currently inside. He has come and arrived uh, in Delhi in order to, of course, uh, take over from uh, the Air India management. Uh, of course, uh, that was something which was uh, uh, anticipated for a while. It was on the 8th of October that the government had announced that the Tata Sons uh, had, in fact, won. One of their wholly owned subsidiaries, Talis Private Limited, had won the bid to acquire Air India 100% shareholding in Air India at a cost of 18,000 crore rupees and after all the formalities have been completed that handover ceremony if you may is taking place right now right behind me at the headquarters of Air India earlier Tata Sun's chairman Mr. Natarajan Chandrasekharan met with Prime Minister Modi as well he called on the Prime Minister because this is a big uh, a PSU which is uh, going from the government to uh, the Tata group uh, privatization was talked about for a very very uh, long time disinvestment was talked about for a very very long time but it wasn't uh, being put to uh, motion if you may for a very long time it was first in 2017 during a cabinet meeting with the cabinet approved uh, in fact uh, you know the privatization of uh, Air India then of course uh, not entirely 100% but then eventually uh, saying that they would be in fact handing over 100% shareholding to the new owners uh, Tata Sons winning that bid their wholly owned subsidiary Talis Private Limited winning that bid uh, in the month of October last year uh, against uh, Mr. Uh, 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 from uh, the Spice uh, Jet group, the promoter of Spice Jet, Mr. Ajay Singh, who was the other bidder in the process. Uh, Tata Sons, in fact, uh, put forward a bid and it was the winning bid. And that final handover, that formal handover is taking place as we speak at the airline's house behind me.
All right, uh, Paulami, thank you very much for joining us with those details. It's interesting to see that uh, Tata Chairman Natarajan Chandrasekharan, right now, the first image that we bring to you, meeting with the Prime Minister Narendra Modi right ahead of takeover of Air India.